Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ishma from Conjured Realm. Okay, so in today's video, like you guys have read from the title, I'm going to be teaching you the formula that I use whenever it is I am trying to manifest anything, including SPs. Now, I used to use this a lot when I first started manifesting, when I developed kind of um, my own technique, when I was starting to manifest. This was before I invented my, like, three flat screen um, method, the one that I taught you guys a couple videos back. This was before that. Um, and yeah, this has always worked for me. I teach my clients this sometimes when I feel called to, if I think it'll work for them, but it has given me a lot of success and I think a lot of you will benefit from this. So I'm here to explain it. So what is the formula that I used? So when it comes to manifesting a desire, my biggest issue back then was changing myself in a way. Because you have to understand when you have thought about a thing that you want and you already have a preconceived notion of that specific thing, say about a person or money or love, you grow up thinking a certain way about these kinds of things that it's kind of hard especially when you're new, to see it differently. So this is what I would do. I would give myself a time span of two weeks to work on a manifestation. That means within these two weeks, I would give it my all. I would not give up. I would not complain. I would not be needy. I would not be... Well, obviously, those things are going to come up. It's just... You need to be able to learn to control them so that they're not happening significantly too much throughout this process. So I would try my best not to become needy. I would try my best not to look for signs and I would try my best not to look for my manifestation. So the first thing you wanna do is identify yourself as the version who is already experiencing your desire. Okay, I'm pretty sure all of you can think of a version of you that already has, let's say, I don't know, a specific person. So can you imagine right now you going to the mall with this person, you having dinner, you going out um, to a park with this person? Okay, that's pretty simple, right? So you can all imagine all these things. Now, what you're gonna continue to do, you're going to keep remembering you with these good memories or these good thoughts between you or your SP or you with that certain amount of money. Okay, for these two weeks, you're gonna do that. And say, for example, you start to do this and doubt starts to come in. You go back to those memories or thoughts that you have already almost imagined in your head and you tell yourself, no, I reject this doubt. I'm going back to my imaginal act that I have made in my head. And you go back to you go at the park with your person, you going to dinner with this person, going to the movies, holding hands. And you just keep doing that and keep kicking out the voice that says, well, this is not going to happen. Or that we don't have evidence of this. It doesn't matter. You gave yourself a two week limit to work on this and give it your all. If those doubts pop up, you're going to continuously keep shutting them down. And this is the part people always mess up and they always tell me, it's not working well because you give up at this stage some people don't like the fact that they have to keep shutting down the voice that tells them that it's not happening it's not working i don't have proof people don't like to do that and this is where you fail because you don't persist enough in the new thoughts of the desire in your favorable outcome if you can do this long enough you will have your manifestation me personally and I do not want you guys to take from my um, success and you know compare it with you because I've been doing this for a long time. So when I do this, it takes me minimum three days, three days. But at the most, at the very, very most, it should take you about two weeks. Week one, and even if you don't, don't get discouraged, just keep going. Week one, you should start seeing signs. You should start seeing like birds before land. And even if you don't, that doesn't mean that's not happening. But from my experience, I start to see them. Week two, before week two is over, you experience your manifestation. And that's all you are doing. 
whenever those doubts creep in, you remember the version of you that's doing the favorable things in your imaginal act or in the things that you see in your head with your SP or with the amount of money that you're trying to manifest, etc. That doesn't matter whatever it is that you're manifesting, as long as you go back to the thoughts of you experiencing your desire in a favorable way every time those doubts and those voices start to pop up in your head. But remember, like I said, you have to continue to persist in shutting those voices down. Even if it's like you saying, you know what, I reject these negative thoughts, I'm not going to listen, I'm going to just continue to imagine my outcome. And so that's all you do. That's literally all you have to do for two weeks. Just do it for two weeks. It's only two weeks. Just do it for two weeks. I mean, Neville Goddard said, realistically, it should take you three days, according to Neville Goddard. But like I said, I will teach you guys a video where I show you what I do to speed up my manifestations within those three days, but I don't wanna overwhelm you, so that's gonna be for later on. So try this technique, see how it works for you. Even if it takes you a little longer than two weeks, I mean, I think by two weeks you should be doing it long enough where it starts to become a habit, you know what I'm saying? And then you can continue it on your own and it doesn't feel so bad as it was when you first started, if that makes sense. So just continue to persevere continue to think about your desires in a favorable outcome me i do it in a way that's almost like daydreaming i don't like oftentimes set time aside to affirm or visualize or script as much as i would like which is why i started to manifest more as like daydreaming and that has worked amazingly for me and you know it could work for you just you know experiment to see what is it that's most comfortable for you and just keep playing with it. Don't take my word for it. Just continue to play with the law. Keep manifesting, keep getting your desires and see how this works. So this is the formula that I used. Give yourself those two weeks and see what happens. And I guarantee you, you will see something happen. Anyways, if you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Hit the bell notification down below so you're notified every time I post a new video. And I am still currently doing one-on-one coaching. Please email me at conjuredrealm at gmail.com. All right, guys. Happy manifesting.